Good afternoon, Sue Parrish here with the Parrish team at Keller Williams Realty. We hope you and your family are doing well. Many of you have reached out to us lately, so uh, we thought we'd share with you some of the questions that we're getting uh, about the housing market in Central Ohio. People are asking, are we at the top? Are we at the bottom? Are we in a housing bubble? Is it going to crash? Are interest rates going to come back down? Well, had you told us we were gonna have this kind of inflation, recession, turmoil in you, Ukraine, we probably would not have believed you. But that being said, here we are. So the definition of a recession is a period of time, two consecutive or successive quarters, where the GDP falls. The truth is nobody knows what's really going to happen, but we can examine the current data and attempt to help you determine what to do, buy or sell in this market. An acceptable definition of a market crash is a decline in value of homes of 10% or more. Well, this market for the last year and a half, two years, has increased by as much as 17% in Central Ohio. What um, we have to prepare for and what we do hear from all the economists is that we are going to have a market correction. So the market will correct. Historically, um, there, there aren't too many uh, shifts in the market. Uh, but oftentimes they come from in a wave of seven to 10 years. And we haven't seen a recession for uh, about 10 years. And so moving forward, we look at demand, supply and demand. When it comes to housing prices, everything ultimately comes down to good old supply and demand, basic economics. Of course, there's other variables like inventory or lack thereof, inflation, rising interest rates. They all matter, but they only matter insofar as how they impact supply and demand. For a crash to happen, we need to see a significant shift from an environment where demand exceeds supply to when there's more supply than demand. We're not going to see that for any time soon, guys. Many people believe investors or eye buyers are leading the demand, and that is not true. Millennials are leading the demand for housing. They make up about 43% of the buyers in today's market, which is great because Baby boomers like me, like Chip and Sue Parrish, we want to sell our big houses and right size to the, the rooms that we use all the time. So as interest rates rise, your purchasing power decreases. So it is important to talk to a lender that knows the market, has been through shifted markets and recessions and things that we're feeling right now uh, to make sure and determine what your credit score is, what your debt to income ratios are, and other very important factors like that. Rent has increased historically over the last 48 months in the United States by 20 to 40%, with one of the areas in the United States being the highest, Austin, Texas. Austin and Columbus have a lot in common. Um, there also is an inventory issue with no houses being built or very few homes being built in the last 10 years. And we have a deficit of about 4 million homes across the country because of lack of building. Investors are making up about 19 to 20% of the market in Central Ohio right now. You know, you're getting those calls from offer pads and iBuyers. Well, if you remember, Zillow iBuyers went out of business in the last year, so they're gone. Um, we are um, asking you, if you have any questions, to please call us directly. You can schedule a, a confidential, no obligation buyer consultation either on Zoom or in person, we'll do either. We can review the home buying process, the fees affiliated with and associated with, the timing of buying a home, and we can also pair you with a great lender that can help explain uh, your situation and, and outline your situation and what um, creative alternative financing options there might be for you. So please call the parish team today at 614-686-HOME, H-O-M-E or 4663, and call Chip Sue and Christy today.